Where's the snoozle? Or what? Pony, okay? No. <laughs> Flurry, that was very, very bad. You could have hurt some pony. <laughs> Flurry, I didn't mean to. Sweetie, you don't have to be scared. It's just me. See? I'm so sorry. I've been a terrible aunt today. All you wanted to do was play, and I've barely been able to pay attention to you. None of this is your fault. So much for being the best aunt ever. But I hope you know how much I love you. <laughs> oh. Hey, can't you forgive me? Thanks, Flurry. How about we head home? After we find your whammy, of course. <clears throat> and clean up. <laughs> this one kind of reminds me of Flurry's hair. <laughs> and this one reminds me of Flurry, too. How so? It's small, like her. I, I can't do this anymore, Spearhead. This has been great, but... Say no more. My art has always spoken to me about what I love, but knowing that it spoke to you about what you love speaks to me. What? Go to her. <laughs> Where did she go? Did she disappear? Did she turn invisible? I just have no idea. <laughs> Flurry, where's our little fool? Oh, oh, we missed you so much. Oh. <sighs> <laughs> but it looks like you had a great time without us. Actually, not so much. Flurry got into some mischief. But it wasn't her fault. It was too much to juggle. And she taught me a really cool bear game. So I guess I... <laughs> <laughs> Well, we definitely should have given you more of a heads up. Yes. From now on, we'll give you plenty of notice. Oh, that would be great. Hey, what are you doing next Tuesday? <laughs> For dinner, not to babysit. <laughs> but I think we're free. Where is Spike anyway? Oh, yeah, that. Well... The dashing dragon warrior breathed a scorching flame from his snout, then chuckled to himself as he flew into the sunset. If you can't stand the heat, don't fight a dragon. Hey, you kind of look like him. Thank you. Okay, now who wants more cake? Yay!